Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you are new to my channel, I will kindly ask for you just to subscribe below and I'll just love for you guys to join my little community here on the YouTube space. So today I'm going to be going through this wig for you guys and how I kind of customised it. This wig was sent to me by RPG Hair. They are a company who have their own website and they sell wigs weaves and things of that nature. So I was approached by somebody from the company and they asked me to pick a wig of my choice and do a review on it and I just happened to pick this one. If you've been following my channel for a while you know I don't like curly hair on myself. Don't think I've ever reviewed curly hair on my channel before or a curly wig or anything that's big like this. I just feel like it just it doesn't do much for my face, my bone structure so I've never really been into it. Much. Immediately I saw it on the website and I really liked it. It's a Tiana Taylor inspired wig after a lot of work, a bit of customization. I have found a place for it in my heart. I do really like it. So you guys just check out what I had to do to this wig for it to kind of become what it is now. So looking at it, I feel like the hairline is a little bit too thick. I feel like there's too much hair and it looks very unrealistic. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tweeze away at the hairline. Don't let this moment hit go to waste. I get chills every time I see your face. So good you could show me some things Oh, this girl my baby is the truth You, when you started Break all the rules for you You're the truth I delete them holes And I'm gonna be tweezing away from just slightly behind the hairline I'm gonna tweeze away from there And then I'm gonna go back to the front of the hairline itself And tweeze a little bit more from that angle Once I try it on and I'm happy with the way it looks, I'm gonna go in with my scissors and cut off the excess lace. <laughs> Now I'm gonna attempt to create some baby hairs and by doing this I'm gonna pull away from the front of the hairline and I'm gonna use a blade to just cut it down to my desired length. <laughs> So off 
camera, I went and dampened the hair. I just put some water on my hands and I ran it through the hair from root to tip. Now I'm gonna use my Aussie Curl Definition Serum, a couple squirts onto my hand, rub that together and put it all over the hair. To allow for the lace at the front of the wig to match my skin tone, I'm going to be using some of my foundation mixed with a tiny bit of my bronzer and I'm going to be dusting that onto the inside of the lace area on the wig. So that's pretty much everything I did to it. The hair is Indian Virgin Remy hair and it's a Tiana Taylor inspired kinky curl pattern. It's 16, just a bit longer than my shoulders. Quite soft to the touch. I haven't put a lot in it. Put water just to kind of separate the parting. So you can kind of see that there's a parting going on. I've customized lace front area just so it doesn't look too full and in a sense kind of a bit more natural. I don't know if that looks natural, you guys. My first time doing anything to do with any kind of customization for any kind of lace front. I think it looks a bit more decent. The lace color is light brown, but it didn't match my skin tone whatsoever. So I had to go in with some of my foundation and cake some of that powder onto the lace area. And it is a glueless lace wig. So I won't be using any glue with it. Um, I never use glue in my wigs. I just don't, I don't think I need it. And the fit is absolutely amazing. It fits perfectly. All I've had to do is use the elastic straps at the back, pull them to their tightest, into the middle, put it on and it, it fits fine. It feels secure. It feels really light on my head. It doesn't feel heavy. I've ran my fingers through it several times just to spread the curls out a bit more. And then I went in with some water to tighten the curls back up ever so slightly. And then I used a little bit of my Aussie dual personality curl defining serum. I've had this forever. I used it while the hair was still wet. So this is a new company and they have a grand opening doing a 25% off sale. And that is it. Please let me know what you guys think. I'm very, very conscious. I don't like curly hair on myself. I don't know what you guys think, let me know. But to be quite frank with you, this is probably the first curly wig that I have said, yeah, I like it. The first one ever, 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 ever. I actually do really like it. I think it's really cute and I will definitely be rocking it for the rest of the summer. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Don't forget to check out the sale on RPG Hair, grand opening sale. Make sure you go ahead and check that out. They're offering 25% off on the entire site. And I've got all the details for this wig as well in the description box so you can check out every single detail and the link directly to the website where you can purchase this wig if you are interested in one. Thanks so much again for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel below if you haven't done so already. And make sure you turn on your subscriber notifications so you don't miss any of my videos coming in the future and I'll see you very very soon bye for now